What's up, Full Ride Nation? We're back for another one. All y'all that don't know me, Christopher Ford, D1 Ball Home Turn Starter, here to help you guys with all your basketball hopes and dreams here for your daily motivation. Today's video is an um, answer to Sean. So Sean asked me a comment he left. He asked me, can he still play D1 if he's not the best player on the team? And the quick and short answer to that is absolutely you can play D1 if you ain't the best player on the team. Let me tell you something about being the best player on the team. It's not about being the best player on the team. It's about being the best at being consistent at what it is that you do. The best at being consistent at what it is that you do. Because understand this, the best player on the team, he'll get a scholarship to a school, right? But he, that's only one scholarship. Remember, schools need multiple people to play on their team. So even if you're not the best, as long as you do consistent work, you stay consistent. You're doing the consistent things. Because remember, your high school coach a lot of times can and will have input on where you're going to play as well. Because the college coach will ask the high school coach, hey, man, how is such and such in practice? How is such and such his work ethic? How is such and such his attitude? And see, if you're consistent in practice, you're consistent in the game, the coach is gonna give you a great recommendation because those college coaches take that into consideration. So it's not about being the best, it's about honing your craft, constantly getting better, as I tell you guys each and every video, making sure that you're doing what you need to do and staying consistent. That's what's gonna get you the scholarship. That's what's gonna get you the D1 look. That's what's gonna get you to the D1 level and being able to perform once you get there. But the performance, again, comes from the consistency of you putting in the work and training Training. If you're not putting in the work and training, when it comes time to show up to the big game, you won't be there because you ain't got the work, you ain't put it in. So stay consistent, maintain your consistency, and you can still make a D1 roster without being the best player on the team. So Sean, hopefully that answered your question. Y'all know the drill, I'm gonna let y'all go today. Um, stay tuned, new video coming up. Y'all know the drill, last compete.